Welcome back to another Illustrator in 60 seconds video in which we're going to briefly talk about compound shapes, more exactly what they are and how to use them. If you've ever played with Pathfinder's Unite Shape mode, you probably know that you can easily unite two or multiple objects into a single larger shape. A compound shape allows you to achieve the same result but in a more versatile manner since it lets you select any composing object using either the Direct Selection tool or the Layers panel and then edit its position, size and shape at any point in time. You can easily create a compound shape by selecting the desired objects and then heading over to Pathfinder's advanced menu and hitting Make Compound Shape or by using the Unite Shape mode by holding down the Alt key. As you can see, the resulting path will take on the color of the topmost object, but since it behaves like a live effect, you can easily change its color or even apply different visual effects such as textures or gradients and they will seamlessly transition from one composing shape to another. If needed, you can easily return a compound shape back to its original components by selecting it and then heading over to Pathfinder's advanced menu and hitting release compound shape. 